Hello, good morning all. Today in this video, we are going to discuss about how to add barcodes in PDF reports. So we have already shown you how to create a PDF report. So if I go to the patients from view, and if I take a patient from here, you can see we have already added a PDF report of the patient. So if I click open this report, you can see we are getting the patient details in this page. So let's see how we can add a barcode to this report. So we have got patient ID here. So let's generate a barcode using this patient ID. So for that, if I go to the inventory and if I go to the master data that is to the products and if I open a products, you can see if I take this product that is chair floor protection, you can see the barcode field is empty right now. So I'll just give a test value from here. So I'll just save it. So once I enter the barcode and if I print the product label report from the print option, that is you have the product label report here. So if I open this report, you can see you will have a barcode in the report based on the barcode you have given. So you can see we are here, here a barcode is generated based on the given barcode in the field. So let's see how we can generate the same in our patient card. So let's go to the patient model that is hospital and then to the patient. Let's generate a barcode based on this patient ID. So if I take the corresponding codes, that is if I go to the settings and if I search for the corresponding report, that is if I search here, that is label. So if I search label inside the reports, you can see this is the product label. And you can see if you click on this QF views and if I open this, you can see this is the code from which the barcode is getting printed. So if you check this code, you can see from here and another template is calling that is a report simple label. So if I search this code, I will just copy the name and in the pie charm if i search the corresponding name so i'll just make a search of the corresponding name that is if i search for id equal to the given id you can get the corresponding record if i you can see yeah what the record if i open this record you can see this is if i expand the screen this is the report simple label and if you go here you can see this is the code from which the barcode is get generated. You can see image alt barcode T if T attribute source. So let's what we can do is that let's copy the same code from here. So I'll just copy the entire table and I'll just control C. And now I will go to our corresponding module mm -hmm. that is OM hospital. That is if you search in the customer rounds, you can see we have the OM hospital here. And inside the reports folder, we have patient card dot XML where we have defined the corresponding the report of the patient card which you have we have printed already that is this report this report so we will make changes inside this code so first of all what i will do is that i'll just comment out this code so i'll just make the code which exists right now i'll just comment it out and i'll paste the code what i have copied from the product simple label report so this is the code i have copied so now i will just make some changes that is i'll adjust the code that is you can see indentation problem here so i'll just adjust the code like this so and if i expand the screen i will just remove the unnecessary lines that is this is not needed for us i'll just remove it and if this is not necessary so let me make some changes in the code that is i'm adjusting the form uh, indentations and removing unnecessary lines so this is not at all necessary okay so we have done with the things so what we have done is we have just added a new table inside the report that is table table class this is not necessary if you need you can add or you can just remove it so I just added a new table that is table class table contents etc is given style border 2 px sorted black is given and inside the table we have defined it row that is tr is for row and td is for column so inside the table row and column we are going to add the barcode so for adding the barcode you can see image this is the format image alt barcode so i'll just remove this t if condition which we have copied i'll just remove it then inside t a t t s r c you have to give this format correctly that is slash report slash barcode type like this you have to give and we have to make changes here you have to this line is same and what you have to make changes is that here you have to make changes that is on based on which field you have to generate the barcode so if i go to the front end you can see if i take the patient's record that is from the hospital and if i take the a hospital patient record you can see the field name is name underscore sequence so as i am active as i have already activated the developer mode if i place the mouse over the field i will get the technical name of the field so the technical name of the field patient id is name underscore sequence 
so what i will do is that so here i will up, instead of barcode i will give name underscore sequence and instead of product we are iterating the docs over o so here you have to give o dot namesec so i have updated the code like this so this is the common code image alt barcode t -ATT, att src report barcode type like so you have to give it and we have to specify which field on which field based on which field you are generating the barcode so that's all what you have to do and under the barcode i will just print the barcode uh, which the id that is o dot this name seek i'll just give it here so you can see once i have given like that you can see under the barcode you will get the corresponding field name on which based on you have generated the barcode so i'll just this is the what patient card you got right now so i have commented on entire code we have seen here and we will just add the barcode so let's go to the apps menu and let's update the module so from the apps menu i'll just upgrade the module okay from here we will upgrade the module so once the module is upgraded and if you print the report of patient again you can see everything will be empty and you will have a simple barcode inside the reports so you can see the module is still getting upgraded so i'll go to the hospital and then to the patients so i'll just choose this xyz imn who having hp 11 as the patient id and from the print i will just print the patient card so it's getting loading so i'll just open the record you can see a barcode has been generated so this is how you can generate or how you can add barcode to a report the simple format is this you have to give only this line that is image alt barcode so let me show you uh, so i will just comment it out the rest of the code that is what we have added for the scene and i'll just add comment it out and just we have only the single line that is image alt barcode t att src report slash barcode slash type so let's see what happens if we upgrade the module right now so i'll go to the apps menu and from here i will upgrade the module so let's see what happens right now we have just commented out the table called code of codes we have added so the module is still getting loaded so the module get upgraded successfully without any issues so we will go to the hospital and then to the patients again so i'll print the report again to see the changes so from here i will open the report you can see still the report got generated with the barcode so what you need is only a single line of the code so image alt barcode t a t t s r c slash report slash barcode etc so this is how you can add barcode to the report if you have any queries or if you have any doubts you can comment it out or reach us over the mail don't forget to subscribe our channel and like the videos push the press the bell icon for notification and more thank you